Here we go again on more New Vegas. Like I said, for the TJ Laser version of this playthrough, which is a different playthrough, he's going to be just pure evil with a big gun. Go to Age of the Gamer to watch that. This is the slightly more serious, in-depth playthrough, which I couldn't do as that stupid character. And for those complaining about why the thumbnails have a sexy bitch in them, where is she? I'm playing with her this time, which I, I didn't do on three. I betrayed you. I'm sorry. Didn't think people were going to care. Yeah, I was saying on the last episode of this that I am addicted to this game now. I actually can't stop playing the damn thing. I can't even be, uh, it's preventing me from doing work. I haven't actually been addicted to a game like this at all since while well, I've been doing YouTube and that includes Skyrim believe it or not Skyrim I actually yeah, never really liked that much to play I thought it was great to make machinimas with but some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Uh, everyone inside is either dead it just doesn't have the the cool style of this game in trouble in this area as well and I like the fact that you can choose to be good or evil in so many quests you can't really do that in Skyrim you're just good really and the only way you're evil is if you do a brotherhood of whatever it is, the dad brotherhood thing or the thieves thing. But that's just a, literally a quest where you're evil. You can't do like Megaton where you sort of save a city or not. Like in, the, in White Room, why was there not a mission where the Yal goes, oh, there's this town of bandits nearby. Uh, go, go get them. And then you get there and the bandits go, hey, we want to attack White Room. Help us. And then you can, you can either massacre White Run or save it. There was nothing like that in Skyrim. It was all just good stuff of fetch quests, dungeon crawling stuff. Just like Oblivion was, really. And I kind of hoped it was going to be more like this. Because to me, it's more interesting when you have options. If it's just be good, or even GTA where you're just evil, uh, I'd rather have the option of doing whatever I want, like Fallout. It's the only real free roam game I've played that you can do both. So, I'm proper looking forward to Fallout 4. I think if Fallout 4 here. comes out while I'm still doing YouTube, um, this channel will probably become dedicated to it. Probably do it machinimas, battle videos, mod playthroughs, all kinds of stuff. If it's as good as this and Fallout 3, it should be better. I'll be obsessed with it probably. This will be the channel to go to for Fallout 4. Hey. Hell, I mean, Todd Howard himself has uh, praised my videos many times. I'm gonna bug him to let me have an early peek at something on it. <laughs> I'll say, look, I'll make you a battle video of Fallout 4 to promote it. Just let me have a quick go on it if everybody else does. Let me visit Bethesda Studios, because I might be going to LA soon. I know it's not in LA, but I'll be in the States at least. This is new NCR mod. I thought the NCR looked oh completely God, boring in, in the brown outfits. Part of the way I didn't want to team up with them. I'm not going to go into uh, Prim and save the town just yet. I want to have a companion. I want to have a companion for that long walk to the light. And there happens to be a new mod companion down this road. An NCR member pwned by some modded blue thing. Oh, look here. We have two gangs facing off. Now, this might have something to do with the mod. Uh, it's a spawning mod, I forget the name of it. 
<clears throat> but it creates more factions, more chaos. So let's see which one wins. I put my mods to put the raiders in here too, so there's more raider gangs running around. Looks like it's an even fight. Oh, no it's not. The team on the left have been owned. So it's the guys hanging around in that building that are all powerful. I've got to go in that building and take them down. People have mentioned uh, me doing like maybe a battle vid with this game or Fallout 3. Not planned to at the minute because it's too difficult to do. The camera work, the way the camera moves is really shit on the Fallouts. It's nowhere near as good as Skyrim. You know, Skyrim was almost built to be a machinima making game. It's awesome in that way. And no other game does it for some reason. They all should do it. If I could do machinimas of every game going, I'd enjoy that. But, uh... I might do it right before Fallout 4 comes out, maybe. Because the hassle factor would be so irritating. This gun's not too good for aiming down the sights, but an instant sneak attack critical kill, and I've alerted them to my presence. Can't take on all those people wearing skimpy outfit. I can't really put armor on this chick because then she won't look like the thumbnails and people are going to complain. You can't have that. The challenge to try and defeat this game just wearing basically no armor. <laughs> this is why I need some companions. Especially uh, with the spawns thing on, sometimes there can be like 60 people attacking you. The NCR have come back to help and he's gone the wrong way. It's the one thing Skyrim did better than Fallout though is the third person thing. They just looked like they're running on ice in Fallout, didn't they? Much better in Skyrim. Hopefully even improved again in the upcoming Fallout 4. Apparently set in Boston. Feel the green energies. Jaguar recruit people. Enjoy! Some Greek joy took him out over there. Got a stealth up on this evil gang hiding out in this Whatever it is, a garage, something like that. They know I'm around, I'm in caution mode. They've only got to look to the left and they'll see me, but they're too stupid. She felt the bullet. Give it away my position. Hide behind the tree, won't we? You're unarmed. I'm not afraid of you. Blow you away. What the? Creatures, modded creatures, no less. A ravager. I'm sure there's a mod creature like that similar in Skyrim. Ooh! 
Heal me. I need to lure these guys to the gang. Maybe they'll deal with them instead. Fuck you. No, he just comes after me instead. Oh my god, another one! Bullshit! Jackal gang member hiding behind vehicles. Dynamite time. Whatever. Not getting him. He's not even wearing armor. Good riddance. Never get tired of blowing things up in Fallout. Enter the building. Close range combat. Unleash the dynamite. Heads up. Can eat that. My head's been grippled. Save me, green gun. The cool new way they explode now, I love it. I don't know if there's more, no, there's no more bad guys in there, just those insectoids. Who's this coming running at me? Hey, did you see a couple of guys on the road just now? They I saw an army of guys on the road, the Biestids. I don't know. This they is crazy like mod bitch guys. with modern day haircut, modern day outfit. Very bright red hair. <laughs> <laughs> because who gives well, a fuck about right. the law of the they game? They took my favorite rifle and some other stuff. I do. It's a fully voiced. Follower, I much like Frostcare, but with way That's more dialogue apparently. Well. And actual so quests, which and it's impossible for me to prove I've been we didn't do with oh, Frostcare. I found it took this. too long. No, I don't need caps, but my pistol is currently used. Stop rambling on and let's just go. I have no caps to pay you, so I'm a great shot. You're gonna travel with me. What use is that to anybody? I want to I'm Willow by the way it's nice to meet you see ya let's go let's go are you ready yeah I'm ready so I was walking off great you know about my rifle beauty what a stupid what thing to call a rifle you call it pwn toy ponage device Oh my yeah. god. Thanks again for your I'm curious what my name is. Let's go. Yeah, I saw this mod for this chick and it was one of the highest downloaded mods I thought. Just checking it. Look at this. An army of queen ants. Now this actually makes more sense in the game because that's a giant ant nest there. Normally you see like what four ants walking around. But thanks to mod power, it's a dimension of pure chaos. Huge fire ant shit. See you later. This chick won't help now, she just runs around in terror. Until I get her a stupid rifle. There she is on fire running around like an utter idiot. Did you see that? 
but somehow surviving it, no way I'm around. I like that though, it's cool. It's a cool new monsters to fight. You will love it. Evening. Look at those powerful statues, they stand for unity and honor. Quite a waste of time building that in this chaotic wasteland. But if they bring a hope of peace to the people. Who are we to question? Coming from the north. Sergeant Kilborn. Must be crazy to brave those roads. Crazy like a fox. Outpost. Mojave Outpost. Watching a lot of nothing feels like a big Brahmin pen for caravans. They've been stopped for a while, waiting for the roads north to clear. Or their clearance papers to go through. Looks like you've walked away, so if you need to shake the dust off, head to the barracks at the bars there. I'll do that, thank you. Nothing I know of. But if you've come from the north, means you can travel freer than most around here. Might check the barracks. Someone might need you to hoof it somewhere. Just be careful you go up on the roof. Got a sniper watching the road. If your gear's for the warning, repair, soldier. HQ's also worth checking out. Talk to Major Knight. He can help. Those two? Represents unification. Unification, yes. Mostly good for shade. Won't do much else when the Legion reaches up. Sun's going down, looks pretty. Look at this place at night. Pretty lights, but you can't see dick. Gonna have to brave the waste in the dark. Who's got the courage to do that? Not me. Street lamps. Where's the electricity coming from to do it? Well, if you look carefully, Mod has added electrician guys walking around and they found power from somewhere and who are we to question that trooper Caravan, major knight citizen pilgrim or stalwart hero we're a stalwart hero just need something for the logbook keeping tabs on traffic throughout the outpost although mostly just in not out these days if you're looking for the commanding officer he's in the back although he's got a lot on his plate so let's do it let's go him, speak to him now Look at that beautiful sunset, so beautiful. Oh. Goons. Millions of goons. I've walked into a trap. Wasn't ready for this. Wasn't prepared. Dynamite for the win. Jackal gang member. Ooh, didn't even kill any of them. No, I'm finished! What you get fighting in a bikini. 